Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. So today we are going to look at my entire colored pencil collection. <laughs> this may be a bit of a long video and I don't know, I think with a lot of my videos, a lot of you may already know what pencil sets I have, but so many of you wanted me to put together one video where I showed all of the different colored pencils that I had. And y'all know me, when I do a video, I have to make sure that I add a little bit something to it. So I think that I'm going to go ahead and for those of you that are watching this video and you're looking for colored pencil sets for yourself, I'm going to make sure for the sets that I show you and if I've done a review on that pencil set, I'm going to try to link that up in the upper right hand corner. And if you cannot find it in the upper right hand corner, I will have a link down in the description box below for the review or whatever it is I've already done with the pencils that I'm showing you. And I'll let you know in the video as I go along what I've already done with these pencils, whether it be tutorials or um, blend tests or swatching or comparisons or reviews. And I'll let you know as I go through all the different pencils what you can find here on my channel. But I won't be able to link everything because YouTube will only let you link five videos for every video up in the right hand corner. So if you go to my channel, there will be a place if you click on videos to go to where you can search my channel. So if you type in that one word like say Prismacolor or Karen Dash Luminance or whatever, you will be able to find all the videos I've done on whatever that pencil is pop up and so that is an easy way to find it. I wanted to be able to do this video because I am so excited because today I hit 9,000 subscribers here on my YouTube channel. So thank you to everyone that supports me in every way possible. I really appreciate you whether you are supporting me by watching my videos, being in a very interactive part of my Facebook group, or you support me on Patreon no matter who you are. I really appreciate you. I mean, you guys do so much for me just by watching, and I really, really thank you for that. If you want to continue seeing my content, please do make sure that you subscribe to my channel. I have a goal of hitting 10,000 subscribers, and I'm getting me giving myself, I think I just did my 8,000 subscriber um, giveaway. And it's been two weeks and I'm already at 9,000 subscribers, which is kind of unbelievable. So I don't know if I am really stretching it, but I'm giving myself, I could probably do it in another two weeks and hit 10,000, but I'm going to give myself three weeks and I would like to see 10,000 subscribers in three weeks and there will be another giveaway coming guys. So stay tuned for that. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, when I go in my analytics and I look, it says that 49% are actually subscribed that are viewing my videos. And so 51% of you that are watching my videos are not subscribed. So please subscribe to my channel so that I could reach my goals. I really, really would appreciate it. So let's go ahead and get into the video. And if you like this video, please do make sure you give it a thumbs up. That really helps my videos to get out and be seen by other people. So the first uh, pencils that I want to share with you, and I'm going to go ahead and give you prices and everything else so that you know where to find these pencils for the cheapest price right now. And I'll try to make sure everything is linked down below. So the first ones I have to show you are, of course, my Prismacolors. And I think I'm going to kind of go down the line and I'm going to start with my uh, more premium pencils or my artist grade pencils. And then I'm going to go into the budget friendly pencils. So I'm going to try to keep it in a little bit of an order. So here we have my Prismacolors and this was my first set that I ever started out with. I've told many of you that I started out with the 36 set of Prismacolors and you can see by looking at this the colors that you get. Some of them I think have been taken out and moved into my case over here to be added to my 150 set because I don't know, I probably have gone through a pencil or whatever and just needed a replacement, so I probably pulled it out of here. But I got through the first three years of my coloring journey 
just using the 36 set of Prismacolors. And I also had the Polychromos, and those were the first two pencils I ever had. And then there was one other very budget-friendly set that I had, and I really can't even remember which one it was, but it was just something that I picked up in Hobby Lobby, and that is how I colored my first few pages. So this, I think, is a 36 set. And then after the first three years, I was finally able to afford to get my first 150 set and so here is my 150 set of course it is in my what most of you know are my favorite cases I will of course have this link down below I've got you'll see as I go through this video I have every single one of my pencil sets in one of these cases and somebody had asked me how I keep my pencils organized this is exactly how I keep my pencils organized it's really the only way for me to do that and I've got I don't have any sets of pencils mixed in with another set of pencils. I have every individual pencil set in one of these cases, dependent upon how many are in the set. I've just got all the different um, sizes of these cases that will best fit my pencils. And I usually keep them in one that is bigger than the amount that I have in the set, especially for my Prismacolors because my Prismacolors I always like to leave doubles of some of the colors, but I'll just flip through this really quick, and they're mostly in order, but really, I don't know, I've, I've got some stuff kind of here and there, like you'll see one of my lighter blues over here, where it probably should be over here with my other lighter blues, and these are kind of mixed up, because with my Prisma colors, I know all of them by heart, and I pretty much have in my mind what they look like when they swatch out because you guys know this is my absolute favorite set of pencils and I am the most familiar with them and these are out because I started um, a page in my new coloring book the forest girl oh my gosh I'm in love with that book guys <laughs> if you haven't already seen the flip through on that book the flip through is on my channel so it's only a couple videos back but I used these colors and I started coloring some cabinets in one of the pages and I wanted to give them a beautiful textured look and I used these colors to accomplish that but that's why these are sitting here because I'm still working on that and I might bring you guys a tutorial on that and show you how to do textured wood I'm trying to kind of make this let me go ahead and show you this is what I've been doing with that color combination and I'm just trying to give them a very textured look in this paper guys this paper in this book is absolutely fabulous it is it works so well and you can see that it almost gives it like a textured look on the paper between the Prismacolors and this paper and I just absolutely love it but I want to make all the cabinets look very old-timey and I'm gonna do the same thing to this wood table and kind of make them match but not exactly so I'm thinking of doing a video where I did tutorial, do a tutorial on this and I do or show you how I do that using the table since I've already finished most all of the cabinets. So these are all my Prisma colors and of course these are just spares and I had bought my kids a set of Prisma colors and they weren't using them and I was like you're not using these I'm taking them so I just took all of their Prisma colors I've got some laying over there on my desk as well and I fit as many in here as I possibly could so these are just kind of doubles but Prisma colors are the one set that I always want to make sure that I have doubles of so I've got those and then I've got these that stay I love this rolly case these rolly cases are really super cool for the smaller sets of pencils and they just kind of like roll up like this and like this and then you just take this and you put it around and then you just kind of stick this through and if I could find this on Amazon I'll make sure that I link that down below but this is the coolest case and it's so portable if you take your coloring out with you these are so much fun and they come in really cool designs. I love that kind of aztec -y looking design. But then I've got another 150 set and when the price really dropped really low on Amazon, I was able to pick up another 150 set so that I could have one for 
a replacement set. I always wait till the price really, really drops on these. And a lot of times, if the price does really, really drop on these and it's a really good deal, I will make sure that I share that in my Facebook group because I always like to keep you guys up to date on you know the prices and when things drop those of you that are my Facebook group you know that I always I am a very um, I would say bargain shopper and I do not buy things unless I find a really good deal so if I find those good deals I always like to share those a few of these have been taken out to replace some in my other sets but you know you could see a couple slots that are missing pencils and those are probably my most favorite pencils I tend to use a lot of the same colors and when I started that page in the forest girl I challenged myself and I said let's use some colors or at least one color in a color combination that you don't generally ever use and try to come up with a different color combination for these cabinets and I like to challenge myself like that sometimes because when you do that it really helps you to kind of pull out different colors and you usually use I don't know if you're anything like me but I think most people are like this and we just kind of tend to stick to the same colors so the 150 set right now on Amazon is sitting at exactly ninety two dollars and the other place I really like to shop to get better deals sometimes it really depends on the day and when you're looking but right now um, Blick Art is actually at $99.74 so they're kind of high right now usually if I can't find something on Amazon for a really good deal Blick Art is always the next place that I go to so that I can see if they have a better deal and sometimes they do and looking at this I know there was a lot of colorist blender talk in my Facebook group today and I was thinking of doing a video on colorist blenders to show you guys how they work or the different things that you guys that y'all can do with them but I'm looking at this and they actually have the Prismacolor uh, blenders right now for a really good deal they are a dollar and 35 cents open stock so that's a super super good deal these are my Caran d'Ache Luminance. I absolutely love these pencils. They are actually the highest light fast pencils and probably the most expensive pencils that most people can get. And I waited so long for these. And this was my first reward after I had started YouTube. I set myself a goal and I told myself if you can reach a certain goal, and make this much on YouTube enough to pay for these pencils and I don't know how many of you know how much you actually make on YouTube but I put a lot of hours into making these videos and when you're starting out on YouTube you have to put months and months and months of work into your videos before you ever even see a penny even after you start seeing something you don't make much at all on YouTube. It took me a little while to be able to make enough to even pay for these pencils because they are rather expensive and I really wanted them so badly because I didn't have or I, ne I never had anything that was above or better than a Prismacolor set and everybody was raving about these pencils and I'm like I just need to see what all the rave is about these and I needed the biggest set because you guys I always have to have the biggest set <laughs> I always have to have all the colors and so there are 76 in here and then you get two blenders with it and all the talk in my Facebook group today was talking about the blenders the luminance blenders and how wonderful they are and they are really good blenders most of you know that I don't too often use blenders in my colored pencil work because I like my pencils to just do the blending for me without using something to blend them together but these are kind of sort of out of place but I still wanted to show them to you since this is my entire collection but some of them are just kind of in here because I am working on something and I really have no other way of separating them but I'm working on something with this and I'm gonna go ahead and get that and I'm gonna show you what I'm working on but that's why these colors are out so this is flowers and gems by Grazia Salvo 
and this is the one I'm working on with these pencils. They do lay down much differently than Prisma colors, but they just blend together so beautifully. Like, y'all have no idea. I've been trying to work on her clothes, and I've taken quite a long break from it, but the look that I'm trying to get in here is where you see a lot of the white and stuff. I'm trying to make her loose sleeves look as though they're kind of see-through. So I'm just still kind of trying to figure out how I would do the rest of her arm, or even if this is clothing on here, or her actual arm, because it doesn't have a whole lot of shape to it, so it almost doesn't look like, it looks like it's almost a sleeve. Or maybe this is her bracelet. I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out so I could see how I want to go ahead and finish this. But that's where I'm at now. But you could see the colors in this set are absolutely beautiful. And they're much different than what I have in my Prisma colors. I even did her skin with this set. And I just, I don't know, I just really love, 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 love the colors in this set they're just really beautiful and I was trying to do something very different with her hair I wanted her hair to be kind of like gray with a little bit of black in it kind of like two-tone so I've never done hair like this before but I really really love it but that's the look that you're gonna get from these pencils I think that they look a little bit smoother or smoother or even maybe a little bit chalkier then what you're going to get when you lay down the Prismacolors, I'm sure they have a lot less wax in these than you would get in something like a Prismacolor because they don't lay down with all of that wax and you don't get that waxy like film over the top when you're using them. But you get the pencils and then you get these two colorist blenders and these are the blenders that was all the talk in my Facebook group this morning. They are really wonderful. And they blend these pencils beautifully together. They work with your Prisma colors. You can buy these separately. And I think you get um, two for about $10. I can't remember exactly, but I think I might be right. I'll make sure that the blenders, if you just want the blenders, are linked down in the description box below. These are my Caran d'Ache Illuminants, and I absolutely love these pencils. The tin is so, so nice. And the reason, the other reason I kind of left them just kind of laying around in there is because I actually bought another case because I wanted to put these in a case in order. And I wanted to not have them in the tin anymore. Or I wouldn't even call this a tin because it's not a tin. It's just... It's more so a box. The box is so nice and it's just got so much protective cushion. Like this is just like a foamy cushion in here. And this is what lays down on top of your pencils. And it's got these little things here just to kind of pick the trays up out with your hands. And it is just really, really nice. Now, let me go ahead and show you in case those of you that are interested in these pencils, I know there's been a lot of talk, like especially this morning with the blenders and somebody had asked which pencils were good. A lot of people and including me had suggested these pencils because somebody had asked what another artist grade pencil set would be if they already had, I think, Polychromos and Prismacolor. This is definitely where I would go next, this or the Pablo. I will be showing you my set of Pablo's next, which is also a fabulous um, pencil set. But this is what the colors look like in this set. I did swatch them out. That's all in a video. I'll try to make sure that it's linked in the upper right hand corner because I don't already have five videos linked up there yet. <laughs> so this one will definitely fit. So if you're interested in these pencils, I think I did a blend test and I swatched them all out, but it has a really pretty array of colors. And then there is also a new set that came out. It's not even really new anymore. It's been months now since it came out, but it's finally available on Blick Art on their website. It's finally in stock. I actually, when I was looking to get you all the prices so I could give you the information in this video, I noticed that they were in stock. So there's 20 uh, portrait 20 more pencils that you could add to this. It is called their portrait set. In the newer set, it gives you 20 more pencils, and then there are four available open stock, and I believe it's about $55 for those. It is actually $55.19 right now 
for the portrait set of 20 but then there are also open stock pencils and it looks like all of those are now in stock too at least the ones I'm looking at so it comes with four open stock I have no idea why they did it that way but each one of the open stock pencils is four dollars and seventy one cents and then you have the box of 20 which they call the portrait set and then to get this set here the 76 luminance with the two blenders on Blick's, Blick Art, it is $233.69. And if you wanted to shop Amazon, in this case, you're going to actually pay a little bit more because right now on Amazon, they are $250.10. And if you shop on Blick, you will get um, free shipping because you're spending enough to be able to get free shipping. I'm pretty sure there's a deal where if you spend something like $45, then your shipping is free, but I'll make sure I have all the links down in the description box below. So these are another favorite of mine, and these are my Caran d'Ache Pablo pencils. These go down very differently. They are somewhat chalky when they go down, and they are applied, they, they have a little bit of a learning curve, and when you apply them, you need to apply them in very light layers because when you lay them down, a whole lot of pigment doesn't come out initially. But as you build up the color, they do get very intense and they blend together beautifully. So before I show you the pencils and the colors that you get, I wanted to show you what I colored with the Pablo pencils. I also colored something in World of Flowers and that might even be on my channel somewhere. I'm really not sure. I'll have to go back and look. But I used the Pablos to color this bird here and then these leaves. I was still in the process of coloring these leaves. They're not done. So these leaves here, this set of leaves here, and the bird. The rest was done in Prismacolors and these are all tutorials on my channel. But this one is a tutorial where I showed you how to color leaves. And, oh my gosh, guys, I'm in love with this leaf. Look how beautiful that turned out. That video was pretty popular. If I don't have already too many linked videos, I'll link that video. But you could always go back and do a search for it. I absolutely love how that leaf turned out. But the bird was colored with Pablo, so you can see that the colors are very beautiful and vibrant. The array of colors that you get in this set is just gorgeous. And you can look at these and tell that I have, you could tell definitely which colors I've used. <laughs> so the, the tin that these come in is really nice too. I mean, Caran d'Ache, when you order stuff from them, they don't play. But like, they shouldn't because their stuff is really, really expensive. But they always give you really nice packaging and, you know, again... I ordered some cases and these were supposed to come out of here but then I got more budget-friendly pencils as you all know very recently and I had some cases laying around that I had set aside for these pencils and for my luminance pencils and so I ended up putting my budget-friendly pencils into those cases so I have to order more cases and now I'm kind of thinking I might just want these to stay in here because the tin is really really nice and each tray just kind of pulls out and it's in its own tin if you can hear that but look at these colors the colors in this set are gorgeous so that is the first tray and then it's got these little plastic thingies here to kind of pull out the second tray and of course the second tray too is in a really nice or has its own tin and you guys know how I'm always like, I need light blues, I need light blues. Look at this set. We've got a light blue here, we've got a light blue here. So you get that in this set, but of course, this set is also very expensive. Look at these gorgeous yellows. This color is so beautiful and different. This one right here, it's kind of like my substitution for my cream. So for this set, like, you know, when I always go for my cream for highlights and my Prisma colors, I always use this color here when I'm using this set for my pop of a highlight. And then this is the last tray, but the colors in here, look at these gorgeous teals. The colors in here are absolutely beautiful. I really, really love this set just for the colors. And this set and, or the Pablos and the Luminance, they play so well together. And so if you had both sets, which 
I don't encourage that because it's very, very expensive. <laughs> but if you had both sets and you can afford to have both sets, both of them work very nicely together and you would have so many colors. But yeah, I am looking to, I'm not buying, I'm not going to be buying any more budget friendly pencils because I am looking to complete my set of luminance so that I have the other 20 plus that four of the open stock that are now finally in stock on Blick. But if you wanted these pencils, I cannot find them on Blick Art, but on Amazon, right now they are $215.98, which actually is not bad for these because you are getting 120 pencils. So I really love these. I love all my artist grade pencils. I love all my artist grade pencils, but if I were to choose one, I always go back to my Prisma colors. Always go back to my Prisma colors. <laughs> now I have my Polychromos. And this is the set that I started out with. This is the 60 set, and this is the very first artist grade pencils I ever got. And this is what I used even before I got my, I think I got these before I ever got my 36 set of Prismacolors, if I'm remembering correctly. I think that this was like the big talk in the coloring community and everybody was using Polychromos back then. And so this is what I ended up going with. And I used these for a little while. And then I decided I wanted to get my first set of Prismacolors. And that's when I got my 36 set of Prismacolors. But these are the colors that you get in the 60 set. And you really get a good array of colors in here. But just recently... Just very recently, I was finally able to afford to get the 120 set of pencils. I was really upset because I was kind of lacking like some of the skin colors and things like that when I wanted to color portraits. So I went ahead and got myself the 120 set. But I've not had a lot of chance to sit down and really use these. I've used them a little bit but I've not really had a lot of time to really focus on being able to use them, especially because I got them so recently that it was about the same time that I purchased a bunch of other pencils or the more budget-friendly pencils, the Brute Fooners and all of that for my channel and to be able to show on my channel. And so you guys know I've done so much work with those and I really wanted to get to know those pencils. So these kind of got set aside and I really need to go back and use them some more. But this is the array of color or array of colors that you get. And there are some pretty colors in here. I told you guys in my videos for my Brute Fooners, the 120 square set. I am excited to be able to use these together. If you saw my blending um, tests and stuff that I did on my review of the Brute Fooner pencils, the 120 uh, square set, you will see that these work beautifully together. And I cannot wait to use them together because the colors just, the colors from the 120 square Brute Fooner set, they just kind of fit right in with all of the colors that you get in this set. So I'm excited to sit and try that out when I have some time, when I'm not sitting here making videos. <laughs> but like you guys know, I spend a lot of time making videos, so unless I get a chance to sit and color in one of my videos, that's usually when I get a chance to sit and color because, and you know, I've really been enjoying doing the color in chats lately because I don't usually do that type of video, and I've started doing the page where I was coloring in Nightfall using the 120 set of square Brute Fooners and I'm really enjoying that because I actually get to just sit and color and still film so I'm kind of getting two things done at the same time and answering your guys's questions and it's just I feel like it's really interactive and it's giving me some time to actually sit down and color while I answer all of your questions so if you wanted the Polychromos the 120 set right now on Amazon is 
And the 120 set on Blick Art is $179.99. So a difference of 99 cents if you went to Blick and purchased them. I guess it all depends where you want to purchase. A lot of us just love Amazon, but sometimes you need to go to Blick Art to be able to get the better deal. These are my Derwent Ink Tents. I love these. I've not gotten, I, I actually on my channel have a tutorial that I did with these. And they do have a bit of a learning curve, but I picked up on it right away. Like, I really, really did. And I love what these can do. And they are so pigmented. I love the way that you could go right back over it with uh, the pencil and make it look like it's a pencil. And you could just keep layering the pigment from these. They're actually an ink that's within the pencil. And so they're water-soluble. They're, ve they're very, very different. They're just kind of like their own kind like there's nothing else like these they are absolutely amazing this is the 72 set and I do have a couple colors let me see what I have over here yeah because I was working on something so there's I also had some colors that were pulled out of the polychromos set so I think that there were quite a few colors pulled out of the polychromos when I showed you those but these are the colors that I have pulled out of this set that's why there are some blanks because I think that um, I'm pretty sure that this case this is the cutest case ever let me show you the difference in the size of this case but this is the big case and look how adorable this is. Like, look at them next to each other. I believe that this is the 200 case, and then this is the 72, and it's just so much shorter and thinner, and it is just the most adorable thing. I just love it. So let me hold this a little closer so you could see the colors, because I don't know. Did I swatch these out? I did swatch these out. So I must have a video where I swatched these. So if I find it, I will link it in the upper right hand corner. Guys, I've done so many videos that I can't remember what I've done and what I've not done. <laughs> there are so, so many, but when I did this swatch, I did it to where I could see exactly what the pencil was like just without water. And then I did it with water so you could see the differences, but there are some gorgeous colors in here. Look at these purples. You've got like some pinky purples and then blue purples and then purple purples. I mean, the colors that you get in here are fabulous. And the array of greens, and then you've got this bright green over here and then your green teals, you get a really good array of colors in this set even having only 72 like they really give you a lot to choose from and once you start mixing them together you could create other colors but that is my Derwent Ink Tents and as far as prices they are I'm looking on Amazon and right now on Amazon they're $106.99 and it says that they are not available to ship in one. Oh, it says they could ship in one to two days. It has the extended date on it, but as I tell you guys all the time, that doesn't necessarily mean anything just because it tells you it's not going to come till a certain date. A lot of times Amazon will ship that out a lot earlier. That has been the case in all of my experiences. And for a lot of people that have done the same in my Facebook group, they've come back and said, oh yeah, you were right. Like I got my stuff way, way sooner than what the date said. So don't look at that date and think you're going to be waiting forever for your pencils. But if you go on Blick Art, you will be able to get them for $107.75 and probably not have to wait and they are in stock. And that is only 75 cents more, 76 cents more. So that's not a huge difference. Next up are my Arteza pencils. You guys know how much I love my Arteza pencils. And if you have watched my Adult Coloring for Beginner series, you will see how much I love them and what you can create with these. They are amazing pencils. I absolutely love them. They are totally worth the money in my eyes. <laughs> Here's another one of those rolly cases, and I think this one is a little bit bigger, and it kind of opens up like that. I think the last one did too, but like I said, these are really super cool. I really, really love them, and you could lay them out flat like this, 
and you can see all of the colors. It's just when you start to get to the much bigger sets, they don't tend to work as well because there's just so many more pencils and by the time you roll it all up, and you roll it in half and then you roll it all up, it's going to be pretty thick. But these are great for traveling with your colored pencils. And I really don't know how big they come. I'm pretty sure this one's a 72. I don't know if they come bigger than that, but for your pencil sets that you've got only 72, these are great for that. But you could see the array of colors. This is how they come. You get some gorgeous colors in here. And then I have a swatch where I've got all the colors swatched out so you could see the array of colors in these two. So that is the 72 set. And this 72 set was actually bought for my kids. <laughs> and I started using them for my YouTube channel and I was like, oh, wait a second, what? Like I bought the 72 set for my kids and I bought the 72 set for my grandkids. And I was just like, I never used them. I was always just using my Prismacolors. And then everybody started asking me about the Arteza pencils and I started using them and I'm like, wow, these are really close to the Prismacolors. They're just a little bit harder. So they last a little, little bit longer and they work so well on the toothy paper and I could create so much with them. Like I'm as comfortable with these as I am with my Prismacolors. So this is the 120 set because when I realized that I went and bought myself the 120 set and I was so happy that I did. Look at these gorgeous colors. You even get that bright beautiful green. You guys that have been watching me for a while, you know how much I love my bright beautiful greens and my bright beautiful yellows. And then in this set you get these really cool metallics. So look at this color. Like these are awesome and in these because they are more budget friendly like I always tell you guys you have to have them swatched because the colors are not going to match the barrels. So here is what the 120 set looks like and you can see you get some gorgeous colors in here. Look at the brights you get and then the brights you get in the yellows. So you get some really pretty colors. You get a more muted yellow but these are all really great highlight colors. You even get very light light grays. Like if you look at this gray here, you get the warmer grays and the cooler grays. And then here are your really neat metallics. And this unicorn purple is so, so different. Like if I was just going to buy this set for one color, it would be that unicorn purple. That is like the coolest color ever. I don't think you're going to find a color like that in any other set. But look at some of these colors. Look at this peaches and cream. It's so pretty. But I really love this set. And if you check out my Adult Coloring for Beginner series, you will see where I used these pencils for tutorial after tutorial after tutorial to show you guys a bunch of different techniques. I want you guys to know if you can only afford budget-friendly pencils and that's all you can afford, you don't need high-end expensive pencils to create something beautiful. I even have a video where I used my Crayolas and colored a butterfly, and I think it was Maria Troll's Nightfall book, and it turned out beautiful, like absolutely beautiful. I loved it so much, and that video got so many views. It's one of the more popular videos on my channel. But you can create some beautiful things with budget-friendly pencils, and I'm going to show you quite a few in this video. I know the video is getting quite long because I'm already done with one battery, but stay tuned because we've got quite a few more pencil sets to look at. These are actually on a really good deal right now on Arteza's website. The 72 set has dropped a lot and it's only $22.99 right now on their actual website. I will have a link for that down in the description box below so y'all can find that and hopefully by the time I get this video up the deal will still be there. I think I'm going to go ahead and post that in my Facebook group for all of you that have been looking for these pencils but if you go on Amazon right now they are $31.99. Now the 120 set is actually a better deal because these used to be $74.99 and they have actually dropped and they are now $59.99 on Amazon. But if you go to the Arteza site, they're actually on sale right now for $55.99, which is a fantastic deal. And I'm wondering if I could find y'all a coupon somewhere. 
but I'm going to check on that and I will let you all know. If you don't see where I have posted a coupon and you're interested in these pencils and they're still dropped to $55.99, let me know in the comments below because I've got so much stuff to link and so many things to do with this video and gather together while I'm putting it all together and doing the editing that I may forget. So if you don't see that, then definitely let me know in the comments and I will help you out. Can y'all tell yet that I have these cases in every single color that is available <laughs> and every different size and every different everything? I love these cases. I will definitely make sure that they're linked down below if y'all are looking for cases. So these are my Spearfarben pencils and I don't know if, I don't know how many of you have seen all the recent things I did with these pencils, but I do have a review on these pencils and I did swatch them all out on my channel. I'll try to link that in a card in the upper right hand corner. And very recently I did a very thorough comparison video with these pencils, comparing them to the other very budget friendly oil based set of pencils, the 120 set of the Brute Fooner squared pencils. So if you have not seen that yet and you're trying to decide between these and the others, I'll be showing you the others in a minute. But if you're trying to decide and you just want to choose one, I advise that you watch that video because it was a very thorough, thorough blend test. And just by watching it on camera, you can make a determination on your own as to which set you would like to purchase. This is the 96 set. I only have the 96 set. I don't have the 72. They come in both. You can get the 72 set for $34.97 on Amazon right now and the 96 set for $44.97. If I were to choose, I would choose the bigger set. I can't tell you offhand what the difference in colors is, but somebody also had mentioned in the comments in one of my last videos where I did the comparison of these budget-friendly oil pencils compared to the um, very budget-friendly 120 set of Brute Fooner oil pencils, but somebody had mentioned in the comments on that video that these pencils are actually available on Etsy open stock. So if you have the 72 set and you want to just fill your set with the rest of the colors to make it the 96 set, you can do that. <laughs> so thank you, Terry, for letting us know that in the comments because that was so helpful, I think, to so many people. But this is what the colors look like. This is all 96 colors and you get a really nice color selection in these. But I really love these pencils. They go down so, so nicely. And if you check out my other videos on these pencils, if I don't have something linked or you can't find something, you can always go to my channel. If you go to the videos, there is always a little search um, feature up there to where if you just type in one keyword, it will show you all the videos I've ever done on any um, one thing or whatever it is you're searching for. So let's go ahead and just take a look at the colors on these really quickly. I still have a few different sets to show you guys, so I'm trying to move a little bit faster because I know this video is going to be very, very long. I hope you guys grabbed your snacks and stuff before you sat to watch this video. <laughs> and I hope you're taking notes <laughs> as to which pencils you think you might want to get for yourselves. Next, in another one of the same cases. <laughs> this is getting old, right guys? <laughs> okay, so now I have my Black Widows. I love these pencils. I have plenty of tutorials on my channel using these pencils. My gosh, I've not gotten to use these in such a long time. Just looking at them, I want to pull them back out and color something. There are the most beautiful colors in this set. And I don't know how many of you are familiar with these. I'm sure most of you are, but those of you that are not, the benefit of these is that there are 144 in total but you can purchase them in sets as you can afford them. The very last set that came out, the Monarch set, is really cool because it came with a bunch of beautiful pastel colors and it just kind of fit right in all the spaces with all of the other colors. Let me see, like 
You can tell the ones that are Monarch. These are Monarch right here. And look at the colors. Like they're just really pastel-y and beautiful and bright. And it just gave you a whole bunch of really pretty highlight colors. And over here, I've got a lot from the Monarch set. And you can see that they're all just very light pastel-y colors. But every color in the set, like, I don't know. The, the colors are just absolutely beautiful. And if you look at these, I believe it came with quite a few greens. If you look at my greens here, you could see that it says Monarch on all of these. And they're all bright, beautiful greens. And they're all from the Monarch set. There's only one in here that is stuck in here that is actually from the Scorpion set. And all these bright, beautiful greens. So I just love these pencils. Really love, love, love them. I'll make sure every individual set is linked in the description box below. And here is the arrange of colors. And if you've not been with my channel for quite some time, you probably don't know, but I was one of the first ones that took all of these pencils, all of the sets when the Monarchs were first released. And I sat and spent hours and hours, just like I did with the Brute Funers very recently, and I took every single pencil from every single set and I put them in perfect color family order. And so this is my order. And I think I did a pretty good job, but I love the way that it turned out. And I swatched all of those on camera with you. I've got that video. I filmed the whole entire process and swatched them all out. So if you wanna swatch your pencils, you can do it right along with the uh, video. So let's talk about how these pencils come. So there were originally, originally there was one set that was released and that was the actual Black Widow set. And right now you can get that on Amazon for $17.57. These are only available on Amazon. I don't know that they have their actual own, own website. I would have to check on that, but you can get these on Amazon. I know so many of us like to just shop on Amazon and they are all on Prime on Amazon. So the first three sets, there were first three original sets and one is the Scorpion and one is the Cobra, and then of course you got the Black Widow, and there's 24 in each one of those sets, and they are each $17.57 a piece. And then they came out with two skin tone sets, a darker skin tone set and a lighter skin tone set, and I've actually got those all kind of worked in here according to color. So mine are just kind, I know some of you keep your skin tones in your set and they are just in their own section but mine are all kind of just scattered throughout because I like to keep my colors in perfect color family order and I think like if you look at them you could see like this one says SD I think that means skin dark so this uh, color came from the dark skin tone set, but that is how they're labeled and they're really nice because you get the black barrel But the gold writing on here really really stands out and they're all different like this set was the scorpion set And it's got the writing all in white and then What else? I think most of the yeah the first few sets have the writing in white and then it looks like they eventually changed it to gold because I'm looking at the scorpions here and they're all in white as well and then of course the monarch which is the newest set those are all in gold oh and then we have the which set is this this is oh this is the original set this is the black widow and so this has red writing on it that's actually kind of cool black widow and it's got red writing but that's kind of neat so the actual first original set has black writing then the next two have the white writing on the black barrel and then the following three the two skin tones and the monarch they'll all have the gold writing and the gold writing really stands out so you could see that kind of over time they have kind of improved a little bit about their pencils because you'll also be able to tell that these have the newer sets are all going to have the uh, dipped tips so you could kind of see what the color is of course it's not going to match up exactly to what you see on your swatch but they do have the color dipped tips and then like this one was from the skin light set and it's got a shorter color dipped tips tip so all of your pencils are going to kind of be different but 
I find them all very similar in the way that they lay down on the paper, and they are really, really great pencils. But the two skin tone sets, I don't remember if I said, they're 11 57 and all of the other sets are going to be 1757 and the monarch set is going to come with more pencils the first three sets come with 24 but the monarch set is a little bit different in that it comes with 48 pencils and that is 2457 and that's a really great deal because when it first came out i think i paid like 33 dollars for it and then of course after all the hard work i did i think that i ended up really promoting these pencils a whole lot just with my video and so a whole lot of people were buying the monarch pencils so the company actually sent me an extra set of monarchs so i was so excited about that <laughs> but a little bit after that they had actually dropped in price and they dropped to the 24 dollars and i think it says 57 cents but that's really cool because you can buy these sets as you can afford them and then once you have all 144 you can use my video and you can put all of yours in perfect color family order and put them into a case. These are my Castle Art colored pencils and I have the ones in that come in the tin as well, but I really wanted the ones that came in the case, so and I wanted to be able to have replacements. So this is the one that, come in, that comes in the case and I wanted to be able to show you guys these because the case that these come in is really really nice actually and i love that it has these flaps right here to where each one of the pencils is just kind of in this flap and you could turn them back and forth and it only has the one zipper so that like you know with the other cases that i love so much you can only open up one section at a time i'm actually going to try to find a find a way to where i could kind of ban something to all of the different zippers and be able to just pull it and like open all four sections or three sections at a time but this one is really cool because you just have the one zipper to open and then they're all housed within that and you've just got each different section i kind of wish that these were on a flap to where they would just turn and not necessarily just kind of flat in the case so these are kind of flat in the case and then the ones all the way on this end are flat in the case but the colors that come in this castle are set this is the 120 set and i love the colors that come in here i don't think that i ever swatched these because i don't use my castle arch that often but i wanted to be able to get them just because i have a youtube channel and a lot of people want to see a lot of different pencils and i like to use a variety of different things just to show you guys what you can do with more budget friendly options but if you were interested in these pencils, I actually just recently got this set when the price dropped and there was a 30% off coupon and I ended up getting these for a super, super good deal. But if you were to go to Amazon right now, the 120 set with the case is $59.99 and if you wanted the 72 set, you could get those in the case for $39.99. And then the ones in the tin, you're going to save $5. So the 120 set is $54.99. And the 72 set in the tin is going to be $39.99. And I don't really care for their tins. So I really just, I really just wanted this. But I really like this case. But that's my Castle Arts. Let's go ahead and move on to the next thing. I still have a few more sets of pencils and they are all in the budget friendly range. So I know a lot of you have seen my recent video, so y'all have probably seen these, but these are the Brute Fooner 180 set. And just to answer your question, a lot of people are asking if these are the same as 180 Sioux Color set. I think I'm saying that right, S-O-U-C-O-L-O-R but I think it's pronounced Sioux Color, but a lot of people are asking, and I think that a lot of people in the coloring community have figured out that these are the same sets. So if you already have the Sioux Color set that is 180 pencils, I wouldn't run out and purchase these because I believe that they are the same. I have not swatched these yet just because there's 180 pencils here, and that's a lot of pencils to sharpen and swatch. And I've even not gotten enough time to actually sit down and play with these since doing my review and comparison with these 
So after I play with them a little bit more, I might come back with a more extensive review on these. I really don't know yet because I've got so many other things taking up my time as far as colored pencils. <laughs> I have so many pencils that like I, I mean, I couldn't use all these pencils in my lifetime. I don't plan on buying any more budget-friendly pencils unless something really, really catches my eye and everyone wants to see a review on it. But right now, I've got far too many pencils. And the only reason, guys, that I have all these pencils is because I do YouTube and I kind of need to have all of these pencils. And so I've kind of worked to be able to afford them just so that I could bring them to you and do reviews and comparisons and all of that. But if I didn't do YouTube, I would not have all these pencils. I would be very happy with just my Prismacolors and probably one set of budget-friendly pencils, and it would probably be my Black Widows and my Polychromos. I wouldn't even have the really expensive pencils like the Caran d'Ache pencils. I wouldn't have either one of those. I only got those just because I have a YouTube channel and I plan on really growing this and doing something with it. So let me go ahead and just show you the colors. And it's kind of hard to tell just by looking at the tips, but if you want to see um, something more extensive or a more extensive um, review of these or comparison to the 120 Brute Fooner, then you can check out my video on that. But this is a lot of pencils, y'all. Like, a lot of pencils. It's almost, it's so many pencils that it's just almost overwhelming. And if I, like I said, was not doing YouTube and everybody didn't want to see a comparison of these two sets, I would have never bought these. Because in all honesty, I, I don't need them. <laughs> I really, really don't. And I'm just, I'm not one of those people that feels like they need to collect everything that is out there. Like I'm perfectly happy, like I said, with my more expensive pencils because the way I look at it is if I save the money and I'm not out there buying all the budget friendly pencils and trying to build a collection of every single set that is made in China, <laughs> I have more money to be able to buy the more artist grade sets. And those are the sets that I really want. I really want the Derwent Light Fast. If you go to the Derwent website, you could actually get a free sample of a pencil. I think that you could do it with the Light Fast and also the um, Ink Tense, I think. But yeah, if you go to their website, you could actually just fill something out with your address and everything, and they'll send you a free sample of a pencil. And so this is the only lonely Derwent Light Fast pencil that I have. <laughs> And I used it, and it's kind of hard to be able to tell because you really can't tell how they blend or how they work when you only have one pencil. So I might buy a couple more open stock, but I really want the full set, the biggest set, and I just, I really can't afford it right now. So I'm just kind of waiting. So I won't be, most likely won't be purchasing any more budget-friendly pencils because I have enough of those and the ones that I have I really love and I'm gonna show you my favorites right now. Okay y'all, another case that looks exactly the same, right? <laughs> okay, so this one houses my 120 set of squared Brut Funer pencils. The ones that I have just been raving about and telling y'all if you're gonna get one set of pencils, one set of budget-friendly pencils, you need to run and get these now. Like, I'm not even kidding. I actually did a thing. <laughs> and went and bought a second set. So this is my second set, as you can see. I've not even opened it yet because I've not had time and I really need to open it and make sure that I have all the colors because I know a couple people were saying that they had doubles of some colors and such in my Facebook group and so they had to contact the company. But that's my second set, and if you guys have not already seen all my videos, I did a review on these. I did a blend test on these. I've colored with them in my color and chat. What else? I have put them all into perfect color family order, swatched them all out so y'all don't have to. If you go to my Facebook group, you will find a translation list and you will also find a swatch sheet that I made for y'all that has room for the name and the number so that you can follow along with the video and swatch all your pencils out. But 
let me show you how beautiful these are. Now, I do have some out, and they are in here, and that's because these are the colors I'm using for my color and chat where I'm answering all of your questions. And so I know someone's going to ask me. So this right here is just from my workout supplements, and I always take all of the... Uh, the paper off of it and I just keep them so that I could put the pencils that I'm using for any one given project. I love using these. I've got a whole bunch of them that I just keep certain um, sets of pencils in that I'm currently using. But let me just flip through here. You guys have probably already seen a lot on these pencils because I am just, I'm all about these pencils right now. I really am. Like I would pick these up right now before my Prismacolors. I didn't just say that. Y'all didn't hear that. That's a secret. <laughs> but I love these. If I didn't love them so much, I wouldn't have bought myself a second set because I'm just, I'm a very frugal person and I'm not somebody that would just run out and buy more pencils. But I really do love these pencils. And for $33 or whatever they are right now, it is just a fantastic deal for 120 pencils. These blend together so beautifully and there are so many gorgeous colors in this set so here is the swatch sheet and these are all the colors I'll just kind of try to fit them all in the frame and move back and forth a little bit here so you could see them all but look how pretty these colors are and if I were buying this set like I've told you guys a million times if I were buying this set for any other reason the browns in this set are amazing like there are no colors in any other set that I have found that are like this the array of browns like you've got browns that have brown in them and pink I mean that is so different I mean it looks like pink to me it's kind of like a very pale mauvey mauvey color it's called it's translated this is actually the uh, translation but it's actually translated to salted caramel and the colors are just beautiful. You've got browns with orange in them. You've got browns with yellow in them. And then you've got a more ochre type brown. I mean, they're, the colors in this are just, you've got so many light colors, light highlight colors, but enough about those pencils. But you guys could probably tell that I am a bit obsessed with these pencils. I really am. <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> Okay, so going down the list, I think I kind of have gone down this list kind of according to price, and I'm getting to the very, very end. So the last ones, or I think these are second to last. I have one other set I want to show you, but they're both Crayola. So this is the 120 set of Crayola colored pencils, and if you guys don't have these, you need to get them. I love these Crayola pencils. I mean, I don't know. It's just kind of like they bring you back to your childhood. And they just, I don't know. There's so many gorgeous colors in here. So many beautiful colors. So those are all the colors. And I've actually, oh, that's the other ones that I needed to show you. But these are the um, colors of the world. And I gave three sets of those away for my last 8,000 subscriber giveaway because you guys were having so much trouble finding them and I actually went into my Walmart and I found them which I was amazed by because so many people were like they're not in my Walmart and they weren't in my Walmart for the longest time and all of a sudden they appeared but this is the Colors of the World skin set or skin tone set and I just kind of added them on to the back of all of the rest of the colors and here is my list of, or here's my sheet to show you all of the different colors that come in here. And so you can look at these and you could see how beautiful these colors are. Like, look at all these bright colors. Here is my absolute favorite in the entire set. It's called Atomic Tangerine. Absolutely beautiful. Look at all these bright, vibrant greens. Some of the bright colors that you get in here, you won't find in another set. So these are also the, um, this is the rest of the 120 set because they didn't fit all on the first, first part of the sheet. But these are just the beiges and the browns and the grays. 
So I really, really love these. I love, love, love my Crayolas. And you can grab these on Amazon. And they're usually right around $22. They're never more than $24. So you're getting 120 pencils for right around $24. And these are wonderful pencils to use. I really, really enjoy them. And like I think I said earlier, I did a butterfly in Maria Troll's book. And these pencils, I also did a flower where I kind of mixed these with Prismacolors in Maria Troll's Nightfall book. I did two different tutorials on my channel with these pencils and one I mixed them with Prismacolors. I also did a one for a video for my 8,000 subscriber giveaway where I colored using the skin tones and I have another one that I did where I colored using the skin tones. So I've done a lot with the Crayola pencils. And I believe that I have a Crayola playlist on my channel that is available to you if you would like to search for that. Or maybe I'll try to link that one as well. I don't know how much I already have linked. But here are the colors that come in the Colors of the World set. So you can see you get some really great colors in this set. But I did one video where I used only these pencils and colored a Deborah Muller page and did just the skin to show you that you do not need expensive pencils to be able to enjoy this hobby. And this is the last set I wanted to show you. This is the Crayola Signature Set. I believe there's 24 in here. It also comes in a 50 set. And like I showed you with all of the others, or the ones that I did swatch out, I've got a swatch of these two. And of course, I did that in my video that I have on my channel, if you just do a search. But here's what the colors in this set look like. So you do get a really good array of colors in this set too, just having 24 colors. And like you get two yellows, and the two yellows are very, very different. One is very bright, and then one is much more muted. So, and then you get two oranges, although these two oranges look very, very similar. Very similar. And then you get two reds, and this one is much darker than this one. And then you get two pinks, and then you get this kind of beigey, or not beigey, peachy color, very pale, pale peachy color. So you get a really good array of colors. You get quite a few greens, as with every colored pencil set. But who doesn't like having lots and lots of different greens in our sets? Like, even if you look at this Brute Fooner set, like I've got greens all right here. And then if I flip it, I have even more greens. And then all of the colors that I have set aside, I have some of the other greens that come in the set here because I was working with greens, coloring some bushes in my color and chat where I was answering your questions. I know this video got quite extensively long, but I hope it helped you all to kind of decide which colored pencils you want to add to your collection, and I hope you enjoyed watching mine. I hope you all have a fantastic day. Everything that you've seen in this video, like I said, I will try to make sure that I link everything, but there was a whole lot. So if there is something that you don't see, then please let me know in the comments below. And I will see y'all in the next video. Happy coloring. Bye.